I'm gonna hold this. You pay this much. Sure. Okay, I'll sell it to you. It's good to get another item expansion. Because I just dug one up and I couldn't collect it, so... So I can carry up to 10 of these. And then we get a high def display device. Alright. Okay, I'll sell it to you. This is like a high definition uh type of thing, so I guess it's enhances your quality. Let's see. This is Fox's high def display device. Slippy air dropped it to you, but the shopkeeper got it first, so why you have to buy it? The shopkeeper never misses a chance to get scrabs. Press the Z button to bring up a display. Use the Z button to zoom out. So basically, this is like some sort of scope in some way, so you can get some like really good uh, view on the entire thing. And I have ten more scrub. Can I buy this? I guess for five. You get map. Cape Claw map. Firefly Lantern. Also, this is the Golden Turnip, and it's gonna require a lot of scrub, so it won't be a while till we get that. Crazor Palace, five, you know, totally. I mean, it's gonna be one of the main areas we'll have to come back to every once in a while, so... Might as well buy it! So, we're gonna have to come back later. Maybe I'll buy more of these maps later on. I'm gonna try to buy almost everything from the shop, but I'll have to come back later. That's okay, though. Now I can pick this up. Really hate these enemies. So this is basically where we need to go next, actually. I had to look it up a little bit, but, um... But yeah, this was actually the last thing I did, uh, during okay, tricky. a certain other recording session. Down there. But I need to help my mom! And you will be by staying out there. Okay, Fox, but hurry up! My mom looked real bad! <laughs> Take fall damage. So I think this is a dungeon, I'm pretty sure. I don't think you can take this thing out. I don't think you can take this thing out no matter what you do. Yeah, I tried, so I don't think you can. You're just gonna have to completely ignore it. For right now, you can't really do anything about these, so you're gonna have to come back later once you do. We can't do anything here, so we're gonna have to come back later. Ignore these enemies. Gotta plant a bomb here. Whoa!
What was that? I will say there's a lot of these switches that you honestly can't really do. I don't think you can kill these guys, just completely ignore them. Blow this up. Summons a little grotto area. These grotto areas will give you another special ability. This is the Staff Rocket Boost. Look out for special boost paths on the ground. Use the Staff to extra rocket power to lift off from the ground of ledges above. Okay. Very interesting. Guess we'll go ahead and try these out. So these things are very special cases, so we're gonna have to, uh, use them, but I feel like you have a general idea of what they're for. Of course, there's also a live area to explore, too. Again, this is a hold switch. You're gonna have to, like, put something here. Overall, right here is where the rocket things are used. Use that to get up somewhere. Get a few things. I'm gonna blow this up. Assuming my aiming isn't that bad. Basically give us more of these spores that we gotta use. You gotta get them while they're fresh. Then I digress. Yeah, they want us to go up here. So once you're up here... Do another thing by playing another bomb before I do so... Yeah, let's do that. Like, I believe doing this will literally destroy something, but whatever. It summons a block, so basically you use that block to go ahead and push that switch. I wish I can kill or just, like, get these mushrooms right off the bat, but you have to take a little bit to get them out of there. Also, fall damage is pretty darn small, apparently. Push this, push this block on the switch. And we go in here. Oh boy, well, 
Here we are. We're gonna have to come back once we have a lantern. That means we're gonna have to do a lot of grinding. Luckily for YouTube, I'm editing out this process, but I'm also live streaming, so you're gonna be watching me do the entire process. Give me all that money. I feel like 30 would be a good number. I think 30 is enough. But we need to buy a lantern. Tricky's ball? No. No. Firefly Lantern, yes. You pay this much. Okay, I'll sell it to you. Alright. I have 10, so hold on, let me go and buy a map while I'm at it. Or maybe I should just save this money? I don't know. Let me buy a map for this level, for this area. You pay this much. Okay, I'll sell it to you. See, so how do I activate the map, by the way? Keep going. Wait, whoa, whoa. What does that button do? Is it like a block? I'm a little bit confused. I'm pressing R button and all of a sudden I'm doing we will do some for attack. I have no idea. That was weird. Volcano Force, Snowhorn, Waste Map. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna need it for this. You pay this much. Okay, I'll sell it to you. So buy it for the Snow World 2. There we go. Trying to figure out how to activate the, uh, map. That's what I was trying to figure out. But whatever. I'm trying to figure out how to activate the darn world map. Oh! I just select it from the, uh, inventory screen. I see. Hopefully I don't need anything else besides just the Firefly Lantern. I know it needs butter- I know it needs Fireflies, but I feel like this guy would give them to me. I guess put a bomb spore here. Okay. And then I blow this up. Freaking uh, analog control. Okay. So how dark can this be? Take out the yellow mushrooms. The white Gertub fungus. You need to collect six of these and feed them to the Earthwalker. Alright, so we need to collect six of these, of course. They could be throughout this uh, dungeon in some way. Just look around. Going up. And these are the fireflies. They'll basically help you light up your lanterns so now you can see better. Oh, 
But don't abuse these things. Only use them when you absolutely need to. Because they won't last forever. They can be really good for seeing, but they won't last forever. Please get over here, let me grab you. If you're really quick, you can grab him. This area here is definitely dark, so that's where you definitely need to use it. If it's pitch black, that's where you're actually gonna need to use it. Only if the area is pitch black and you can't see shit. Where is my bomb? Oh, I used them all, probably. I gotta get more. I gotta get more bomb spores. They like to try to fly away from you. That's basically what they're gonna try to do. There we go. I think four should be enough. Wait, what am I? Oh yeah, this one. Down here seems to be like a bombless pit. But really it is a bombless pit, but they really want you to use your lantern. Let's see here. Alright, right here for a want you to use the uh, bomb spore. Figure out where I'm at. There we go. Okay, so right here is where I need to be. I should be able to see from where I'm at. And fire. We basically destroyed part of that pillar, which allows us to do a little bit more. Also, there's a bomb spore plant right up there. Before we do so, what's over here? Oh, another bomb spore plant. Look around before I use it. Okay. And fire at will. If I can aim. Gosh darn. Sensitivity so bad. Got it. I have four out of... out of six. So we gotta make this jump, and then go this way. Oh, that's where the remaining two are. Got him. Alright, so we got all eight. We're pretty much ready to go. Apparently did not get that one, but you know, that's okay. But anyway, so we got all the white scrubs, so we're pretty much ready to leave this mini dungeon, if you like to call it that. I'm not sure if it's a major dungeon or a mini dungeon. Hey, we got that out of the way, so...
So I think we're ready to go and leave this place. I can almost never avoid these mushrooms. We're gonna go ahead and help out your mother. Like that. Get more of that. And let's go ahead and help her. Here you go. Thank you, Fox. Thank you for saving my son and for saving me. Okay, okay, enough of the thanks. Now I need some help from you. Can you just tell me what's going on? This is all the work of General Scales. He is the ruler of the Sharkclaw tribe. A nasty bunch of pirates who have always wanted to rule Dinosaur Planet. We have always been able to stop his attacks. But this time he somehow becomes stronger and defeated our army at the Krizoa Palace. Right, a bad guy. But how did the planet get in such a mess? Within the Krizoa Palace, he broke the seals of the Force Point Temples. I'm listening. This planet is rich with a magical force. A force so strong that it is continually pushing our world apart. To stop this, four spellstones were placed inside the Force Point Temples. Uh, okay, that's a bit weird, but I understand. With the seals broken, Scales entered the temples and removed the spellstone. With nothing to hold back the magic force, the planet was torn apart. At last, it all makes sense. So, the bad guy takes the spellstones, your planet falls apart, and I've got to find the spellstones and bring them back to the Force Point temples. See, Mom, I told you he was good. Starbox, yeah. My son will remain with you, for only a dinosaur of noble birth can breathe life into the spellstones. What? Uh, that's okay, but don't you think he's a bit young? Uh, I mean, it's gonna be very dangerous. Loads of bad guys, fighting, death. He knows the planet well, and I'm sure he's shown you his sidekick skills. Oh yeah, I forgot about those. Come on, Fox. We'll make a great team. Okay, but if you mess up just once, I'll send you straight back to Mommy. Okay, yeah, yeah. Good. Now, our spies have indicated that Scales was last seen in Dark Ice Mines. I know the gatekeeper, Garunda Tay, a silly fellow, but he can guide you to the Spellstone. Go back to the Snowhorn Wastes and find him. Got it. And Fox... I think you'll need this. The Shark Claws dropped it when they attacked me. Maybe it'll come in use somewhere. Okay, enough already. Can I just get on with it? Fox is pretty much more into the action, of course. But anyway, so we got the Shark Claw Prison Key. He must have dropped it when they attacked Queen Earthwalker. But yeah. Can't go that way yet, but that's okay. We need to go back to uh, the snow level. Get over here. Overall, overall, basically, uh, Tricky is gonna be your psychic partner throughout the entire, uh, throughout the entire uh, thing. 
he can be some really good useful, so, um, definitely use full advantage of him if you possibly can. He can help you dig out for certain secrets, such as these, like, revivable type of, type of things, cause, and considering that I just picked up an upgrade that allows me to pick up ten of them, someone tells me that this game's not gonna be easy. But we'll just have to see. Let me turn around, I just fall soft soil, and I'm gonna activate it. Wherever he is. Can't tend to get up here, apparently. But I'm gonna need him, so that way, um... Get another thing here. Sometimes he can't go to where you are at. Candy'd open this up, so... There we go. Now, I don't know what's over here. I don't think we're supposed to go over here, but it's always good to look around. Must be stopped before it's too late. Yeah, we gotta stop them before it's too late, yeah. Fine. Yeah. This area is uncharted. I'm so confused. Damn it, let me feed you. I have no idea. I feel like we just gotta get there on foot. Because apparently Tricky will only be there with you if you travel on foot. Likely these scarves will respawn. I want to fill up my uh, wallet a little bit. But I don't think I want to fill it too much. Climb up this entire ladder. And then I'm assuming Tricky will somehow be behind me. Yeah, Tricky will somehow be behind me. So how on earth did he climb ladders? I'm not sure. But anyways, what we actually need to do in order to get back over here is we need to basically make Tricky uh, stay on this little switch. Assuming if he's able to cooperate. There's something near. Yeah, there's something on top of you. Can you please stay still? Stay. Because what I need to do is reverse the, uh... What I need to do is reverse the, uh, water flow so that way I can go the other way around. I'm not doing it, says, uh, Trippy. Anyway, so now we can go this way, figure out what's up here. Cause there's something up here. Or rather, not really, because, like, all what's in here is just a little gray wall. Maybe I gotta do something first? I have no idea. 